Again, remind New Progressive Collective who you are and what this oh, is. Uh, my name is Andy Anderson, and uh, this fellow here is Dave Cook. Uh, we are coaches, volunteer coaches for uh, the Science Olympiad team in Arlington Heights. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. And he's been, Dave's been doing it uh, for over five years now, and I've been doing it for 21. Uh, awesome. So uh, the, the Science Olympiad program exists on volunteers from the community. All, all the coaches, a bunch of volunteers. Some have kids in the system, some like me don't. But it's a tremendous program to help kids learn. And they're much better prepared for college when they come through the Science Olympia. Totally awesome. Yep. No, totally. I know. And the next, uh, the next event that you. Uh, uh, you well, the, the event that's running over here. In the middle here, this will be a robotic event where they will have to pick up ping pong balls and pencils and Legos and put them in those uh, milk cartons. They'll have robots that sit in the center. Egg cartons. And over on the other side? Over on the other side. Uh, Want to walk over there? Yeah, well, you can walk over there. Walk around this way. That's, uh, well, that's, a, that's a high school filming uh, uh, electric, electric vehicles. Mm -hmm. This is a high school event over here. Oh, that's awesome. awesome. That's, Too awesome. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, these, these vehicles, uh, the, the object of these electric cars well, is to uh, come down and stop as close to the line as possible without going over it. So, you can stand over here and film one of the cars. Yeah, yeah, just, you, can, you can film that car. They're getting ready to run that car now. It'll go down here and he started and then it'll try to stop close to the line out here. Here it comes. A little battery operated car. No, it went way back. Wow. Okay, come here. 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 Okay, Oh, this. So they measure, you get penalty points. They measure from the line it's supposed to stop at, they measure how far away it is, and you deduct points from your score. Then. The cars are scored on how fast they travel, the line, how close they stop. So now are they going to come back this way? No, they'll, well, they'll, uh, they, after they measure that, they'll pick it up and they'll get a second run. Okay. They get two runs. Two, two tries, I think, unless that was their second run. Was that your last run? No, that's, that's the first one. So they're going to do another run. So they will make the adjustment on the brake or whatever they need to adjust and try to have a, a better What's run. going on over there? Over there, uh, I want to walk like are, in the middle here so we yeah, can see both. Yeah, yeah. Oh, where are you? Kind of like an engineering. You have to figure out what the best is. That looks this interesting. Is, this event is called uh, Air Trajectory, and it, it, uh, 
a falling mass uh, compresses air in the tube and they fire a ping pong ball or a racket ball out toward those targets that have sand on them. One target is close and the other one is farther out and they get two tries to try to get the center of each target. And they measure, measure how far away it hits and they deduct that from a perfect score. So, the ping pong, I think it's a ping pong ball they're firing. Maybe going to the close target here. Nope, it's a car target they range. So they measure from the center of the target, they measure how, how many centimeters from the center away from it is, and they add that to the score. So, so it's like the low score wins, like in golf. If you're a meter away from the center of that target, that's more points, and you have a higher score than if you're close to the center. So if you hit near the center, you have a lower score. And the closest you can get to the center dots on those targets, that's what will produce a winning score. And you get two tries, so you get the best out of each two. Fire, you're going to fire another one in just a minute. And I guess they're shooting at the uh, closer target now. And if they have, they, they have the option, they have the option of uh, firing in a bucket that they will set out here on that red dot. If they don't want to waste the second shot going for a good target, if they get a good one on the first try, then they can try to get an extra 100 points getting a ping pong ball in that orange bucket. They'll set the bucket out there if the team wants to use up one of their shots on it. I'm not hoping. Yeah, they're firing a the ping pong ball. So that one was successful then? That was a successful run where the first one went way over the line. The first one went way over the line. It was not a good run. They were able to calculate and correct the second run. Now this is the second shot here. I think they're shooting toward a small target. Let's see. Yeah, and look at where that ball hit. It hit right near the center about six or eight inches away or something. And that's going to be a good, a good shot. Oh, cool. The other one went, uh, so that one was yeah. 15 centimeters, 150 millimeters. 15 centimeters is about six inches. That one hit about six inches away from the center of the dot on that target, which is a very good shot for something like this. Now they're going to try to hit, uh, get a ball, see if they can get a ping pong ball. If it goes in the bucket, you get another 100 bonus points. So that, that's a good thing to aim for. Well, it, it, the judge is telling them where, where it is out there. So they calculate, they calculate the air pressure by using different weights that uh, fall in the tube. They have they have a little uh, a little jar that slips down in that tube, so they change the weight. They change the weight in the jar. And the jar sits, and when they pull the pin out, the jar goes down there and pushes air down into the bottom and forces the tube. Oh, kick ass. You, 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 you got that on film? Yeah. yeah. That's, a, that's a great shot. It's that's got awesome. Ping pong ball right in the bucket. That, that may be the, the gold medal winner. Wow. And now they're going to do another. Uh, well, they, they'll be running cars here for another hour, probably. This is an afternoon event. 
Why do 